In this video, I will show you how to download Eve NG Community Edition, the latest and updated, and install on VMware Workstation Pro. So the latest and updated version is 6.204. So let's go to the website. Uh, the website is www.eve-ng.net and click on the free Eve Community Edition. So uh, there is two options available, Mega and Direct Link and you need to download the ISO file. It's almost 3.2 GB. Uh, there is no more UVA or UVF file available, only the ISO file. And this is the latest and updated version of EPNG Community Edition. So you can download from either these link. I already download because it will take some time. Let's go to VMware Workstation and go to File, a new virtual machine, a custom advanced next and keep the default next okay i will install the operating system later and choose linux and choose version ubuntu click next and give them a name in this case eve community edition okay and choose the location where you want to install click next and give them number of processor in my case i will give them four click next and give them a RAM. Okay, in my case, because I have a 32 GB, so I can allocate 16 GB, it's up to you. Okay, so I allocate 16 GB, click next, and choose the interface. Make sure uh, the interface is net, okay? So it will get the internet as well, and also you can access easily this Eve NG Community Edition from your browser. Click next, keep the default one, and click next keep the default desk type click next and here create a new virtual desk the default first option click next and here give them uh, the disk space so i will give them 200 and choose the first option store virtual disk as a single file click next and this is the desk file it will store here click next uh, before finish you need to customize the hardware so memory is 16 GB, you can change if you want. Make sure under the processor, this option is enabled. It is very important, otherwise your firewall, router, switches will not work. Okay, go to the CD and DVD and choose the ISO image which you download from here. And my case is here, this one, 6.24. Okay, after that, network adapter is okay. USB, I don't need to so remove. Sound card, I don't need to remove printer i don't need so remove and click close and now you can finish after that it will show you here and power on the virtual machine okay just let me close and hit enter so this is the latest and updated version of eve ng community edition to install on vmware workstation okay so it will take some time and after that it will start the installation process so let me pause the video for a while when it started uh, then i will come back okay because it will take some time then it will ask you uh, the uh, which language okay the interface language it will ask you then you need to choose english it's up to you i will choose english and then i will hit enter so let me pause for a while Okay, so it's back, choose English and hit enter. Uh, you can see on the top is mentioned that choose, uh, use the up, down and enter key to select your language. So hit enter and choose the uh, keyboard layout. So I will choose the default one and hit enter. Okay, and here down arrow and choose continue. Are you sure you want to continue and hit enter? Okay, if you want to see the logs, so you can click view full logs. So it will take some time and after that it will restart. And when it's restart, so it will start the process again. I will show you and again it will start. And then after that you can configure ENG Community Edition. So again, it will take some time. Let me uh, pause the video for a while and then I will come back. Okay, so it show you the option reboot now. However, we will wait and it will automatically restart. You can see it's going to restart automatically. Okay, and again, the process will start. 
let's see maybe it will ask you uh, in the middle sometimes it's ask you the username and password so you don't need to enter like here it's a, a second stage installing install in a uh, progress by the way but it show you the uh, login detail eveng login so you don't need to enter anything you need to wait for a while it will start the process again okay because it, it say it's a second stage of installation uh, so you don't need to do anything uh, sometimes the student uh, confuse and they type the username and password but it will never accept you see it started again so keep in mind this point and just leave them for a while so this is the second stage of installation okay and let me pause the video again because it will take some time more uh, i believe it depend on your configuration it will take four to five minutes okay so it's restarted again in the second stage and now it's okay on the top it will show you the username and password so root and password is eve and hit enter so now the process has started so i will say keep the same password eve and hit enter eve hit enter uh, make sure don't change this eveng this host name because the switches are registered on this name so it will not work just keep everything the default hit enter 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 and we are almost done so it will restart so uh, i believe it's three time it's restarted okay uh, this time it's done and when it's restarted it will show you the ip because i'm using net so it will show you the net range ip 192.168.114 something so let's go yeah 114188 so you can go to your browser and type that ip http make sure and 192.168.114.118 something it was 188 yeah so let me type 188 and hit enter okay here the username is admin password is eve and hit enter and now you can open anything let me give them and it's now available okay right click nodes we don't have a nodes you need to upload and that's it so this is the way to install the latest and updated uh, eve ng community edition on vmware workstation pro